Hey, hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. And if you're new here, welcome to the Vibe Tribe family. Today, we have a hodgepodge of unboxings. We've got DAC friend mail, we got Rachel Ray, Treasure Studios Art, AliExpress, and my DAC experiment. And I'm gonna leave it at that, so I think we just need to get into it. If you're not already subscribed to my channel, I'd love to have you stick around and join the Vibe Tribe family by hitting the subscribe button. If you like today's video, make sure you hit that thumbs up. If you don't like it, oh well. Don't bother me. Thanks for the watch time. And don't forget to hit that notification bell as it lets you know when I upload. I am uploading right now until Monday when I go on vacation and then no more until I get back. Okay, you guys. Many, many blessings. Hashtag Vibe Tribe. Let's get into this unboxing. It's interesting and squirrely and just a typical Sherry video. Okay, let's go. Hey, hey everyone, happy Friday again for video number two. <laughs> and as you can see, I didn't have a mail haul the previous week because there was no mail haul to be had. And now there is. So one of these boxes from Diamond Art Club is friend mail. Another one is an experiment I did with Diamond Art Club. Something from my, this is my own experiment. No one knows I, no one knows I did it. And then I've got, I think, some friend mail in the China mail. And I'm not quite all sure. The pink one is Treasure Studios Art. I'm not sure which this one is or what, who it's from. I'm not sure which one this one is. Or, you know, I do have a couple things I'm still waiting for from AliExpress. But we all know how that can go sometimes. So, I want to touch base on something here when it comes to friend mail, okay? Friend mail is not something that has to be done. It's not something that needs. I will humbly accept it because over the past few days, quite a few of you have reached out to me wanting to send me something as a thank you or whatnot or what have you. And I'm always going to say it, you don't have to. I unfortunately cannot gift you back because of my situation. I've got my giveaway winners dealt with. That's all in. And most of you are saying you don't have to send something back because you're already helping me and you don't even know you're doing it. And I'm like, okay. You do you, honey boo boo, I'm gonna do me sweet pea, okay? Other people have asked, what can I get you? I don't know what to tell you. So that's why I have my PayPal link down below there, yeah, down in the description box, way down there today, because there's gonna be a lot of links down there, because I will have everything linked down in the description box. But if you're unsure and you want to, but you don't have to, it is appreciative that people want to support your channel. And it is appreciative that people want to support your journey. When I give a super chat to another creator, that's my way of supporting them without sending mail. It's not me sucking up. It's not anyone sucking up. It's saying a thank you. Now that I'm a creator as well as a subscriber and viewer, I get what that means now. Because I want to support channels. So when people come to me and want to support my channel, I will humbly accept it. I'm honored and I feel so blessed and I feel so grateful for everything, everything that has been bestowed upon me. Okay, now that we got that out of the way, Squirrel! <laughs> I'm gonna get organized. I will be back in a few, well, a millisecond for you. And we're gonna start opening this up and seeing what diamond painting duties are in here. All right, let's do this, boys and girls. And I'm back. And I'm pretty sure, as you guys can tell, that we are working in my kitchen, well, my kitchen counter island. And I've got some information I'm going to be sharing with you guys soon that I'm so excited for. And I cannot wait. It's huge. And I'm excited. And it affects Mr. Addiction, my kids. 
But yeah, if you see some scuffing, this is granite. I'm gonna tell you guys right now, don't ever get granite countertops. As much as they're beautiful, they are horrible to clean. Oh, especially if you have OCD. Okay, that was a little bit of a squirrel. So we're gonna open up Miss Rachel Ray's, the very, very first package of this unboxing. I went to her Etsy store, which I will have linked down below. Oh, oh, oh no, I got something I shouldn't have. Okay, no, this is just my receipt there from her. And there's the, oh, in, oh, see, this is the little stuff, you guys. It's the little stuff. And look, it says, enjoy today. Is that a sticker? It is. Stickers, stickers. Sorry, squirrel. Oh, it's fun, you guys. I got a penguin. I got a penguin. I got a penguin. I got a, yeah, that'll be going into my mouth like up uh, soon. So thank you very much, Rachel. I have been waiting to try the p -p -p pick up a penguin. Oh, yeah. Mm -mm. Uh -uh. All right, so, and then the card. Thank you, Rachel Ray Craft. So there we go. If you're wanting to see, you can pause and you can see, but I think most of you know who Rachel Ray is. And if you don't know who Rachel Ray is, of course, I'm going to have her Etsy and her YouTube channel linked down below. But if you're not sure who she is, then I don't know where you've been. Ha! I'm just kidding. I'm just being a smart ass. It's Friday and I'm in a good mood because I'm going on vacation soon. All okay, right, so you guys ready to see what I ordered from Miss Rachel Ray? Look at this. Like, she does, like, these little... Rachel, I like this. I don't know what it is, and I don't know if it's just me, but when you get something and it's presented in such a lovely way, like, it's the cherry blossom pen. Like, look, you guys, and it's like... Woo -woo 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 I love it. I love cherry blossoms. And I'm thinking, I'm not sure, like there, I think this goes with it. So it goes, okay, I'm feeling, I'm, I, guys, I'm feeling a little stupid here. Like, I don't know what to, okay, I got two parts and I'm not sure what I'm supposed to do. I, I'm sorry, squirrel, the squirrels are crazy right now, you guys. They're crazy, crazy, crazy. Let me do that. Whoopsie. <laughs> but I don't like to show my address because I only give my address out to people that I trust. So I'm not sure, but if someone can explain to me why I have two pieces, I'm feeling a little silly and a little goofy. And yeah, I don't know if it's just me, but yes, I love this. Cherry blossoms, lotus flowers, and sunflowers are my favorite flowers. So when I seen this pop up in her Etsy shop, I'm like, yeah, that's mine. And I love, oh yeah, yeah. See, that's going to distract me while I'm diamond painting and I love it but I'm not sure what this part's for and I'm feeling a little silly. So that will be package number one. Thank you so much, Rachel Ray. I truly appreciate it. Okay, we're gonna set that there. We'll set this, that there, we'll go this here. Oh, she let a little note. Thank you, Rachel, so much. So I ordered this on July 11th, you guys. She has the information for me. I ordered this on July 11th. And I received this yesterday being July 25th. And that came from Ireland very fast. So Rachel, thank you so very much. And I'm nice to know that we have the same taste in flowers. All right, so now we're moving on to the pink package that's in a boot, but I'm okay because I know what's in here. And normally I don't like the boots, but because I know what's in it, I'm good. So this is from Treasure Studios Art. As you guys all know, if you don't know, I am an affiliate with Treasure Studios Art. And my affiliate link 
and discount code is down there, somewhere down there in the description box, go way down. And if you use that link or my coupon code, it's gonna save you 15% off your order. Yes, I do make a commission, but right now my, con my commissions are going to the Kidney Foundation, as you heard in my previous video today. If not, you can go check that out, but I am donating my commissions to the Kidney Foundation. So why don't we break this open? Because Rachel from Treasure Studios Art mentioned that she put a little something in here for my grandson. <laughs> Rachel <laughs> Really? Oh, that's for the grandbaby. I'll show you guys in a minute. Quit being nosy. We gotta do the original thing first. So we'll do that and then I'll show you what she sent for the grandson. And I'm just being a smart ass, you guys. I'm in one of those goofy moods. So I had to get on board. I've seen a couple people in the community get these and I love the tree of life. And when I seen these LED diamond painting lights, I was like, I gotta check that out. I really, really need to check these out because they look so cool and unique and different. And I wanna bring different and unique to the channel and share with you guys. So I see these and I'm like, I wanna try this. And plus it's got your special diamonds and so whatnot. So I ordered this Tree of Life on June 29th. I ordered it with another diamond painting, which I'm still waiting for. You'll get to see that I'm thinking next or when I get back from vacation. If unless it's in here and I'm just not aware it's in this, this stash over here. But I ordered, I paid $14.50 Canadian for this LED lamp. Okay? And I'm like, why not? It has free shipping. It's $14.50. Right on. Awesome. So with this here, you get your generic toolkit, you get your pen, you get your boat with no spout, you get a little chunk of wax. You get some baggies in the back. You don't need much more than that. You guys really, when you, if you're just working on an LED light, but if you're like me and you have addiction issues, you got pens and you got trays and you got all kinds of goodies. So I'm not even gonna take that out. We know what it is. Then you get your little thing here on the back is where your batteries would go. So let's see what size batteries. So it takes two AA batteries to light it up. This I'm gonna take with me on vacation because this is gonna be a little afternoon sitting on the deck project that I can do. So there are your bulbs. It has five bulbs. I can't count because I thought it was six. It's five bulbs. There is where you would attach your light bulbs to right there. So obviously while you're working on it, you know, I, so the way I'm gonna work on this, you guys, is I'm gonna go like this here. I'm gonna take it like this, I'm gonna set it down and I will do it once all this, this gems and stones are on it, then I will put it on here. And I believe it's gonna be the light bulbs that are gonna hold this on. Wow. This is gonna be so much fun. This is like one of those fun projects, you know, like, well, diamond painting's fun, period, but I usually go big, big projects. And it's gonna be nice to have a snack size, a mini snack. This is a snack of a snack, is what this is. So here are your stones. Oh, wow, pretty. Like, look at those, you guys. 
Are those not gorgeous little, like, the special stones? Rhinestones, crystals, whatever you want to call it. Tomato, tomato. Roof, roof. We all say things differently. So very, very nice. So I bet you're probably wondering what Rachel got for my grandson. I'll show you guys in a second. So she told me she got something for Grayson. She created my custom of Grayson. And look what she sent you guys. An LED light and a teddy bear for him. It's okay, my sister. You're, my sister's here. She pretty much lives here with me, but I'm good with that. She could like literally, like Mr. Addiction can go live with the brother-in-law and she can live here. We're, it works, we'll just meet in the middle somewhere, right? <laughs> Spend a day with him here and there. Yeah, exactly. But look, it's a little teddy bear one. Rachel, thank you so much. Oh, that's not little. Oh. Good cry, Rachel. Thank you for thinking of my grandson. Look, you guys. The bulbs are already in it. I just got to put the stones on. That's going to make a cute nightlight in his bedroom. It is going to make a cute nightlight in his bedroom. Aww. So I don't want to take out the stones. It's the same thing. I'm going to take that. And with this kit for the teddy bear, which is bigger than the tree of life, you get a bigger square tray. You get your pen. You get a bigger square chunk of wax and you get, you know, the typical tweezers right there. But again, if you're like me and you're a diamond paint and junkie, then you got all the gadgets and gizmos that go along with it. So I'm gonna pass this to my sister and we're gonna, I don't know how much that costs. I don't have any of the information for you guys, but Rachel, from the bottom of my heart, thank you. Thank you for thinking of my grandson and realizing how special that little boy is to me. And when I get back from vacation, you guys, you will get to see the Tree of Life LED lamp. You will get to see the teddy bear LED lamp all done and finished. So thank you so much, Rachel. And I will be back I'm in a sec. So now we're gonna open up this one here. I'm not sure you guys, I know I have friend mail coming from quite a few of you who just asked for my address. You didn't tell me where it was coming from. You didn't tell me what it was and that's okay. So if I don't call you out by name or thank you, or, you know, I'm not sure if it's from you, but you're going to get to see my reaction to what it is. So I'm thinking this is friend mail. I might. I don't know. I don't know. I, I, I don't know. Quit, tr quit trying to figure out Sherry and just open up the package. <gasps> okay, you guys can't see this one yet. I'm sorry. It's for a different video. Sorry, guys. Moving on. I'm sorry, you guys. No, I just left you out. Like, what was it? Sorry. See, I got so many different things coming. And I have a video idea I want to do, and that is for that video idea. So I can't do it. It's that one, remember I was telling you earlier, Dawn? Uh -huh. Yeah, it's that one. Okay. Okay, so that'll be for a different video. I'm not even going to take it out of its packaging. I just seen the photo of what it was. Moving on. Oh, I just broke the boot. The boot's leaking. I don't hate it. Like, this is so gross. It's dirty. I don't like the garbage bags. Uh, there's, it's, it doesn't have a foam roller. Okay, I don't know if anyone from AliExpress ever really watches what we do, but the boot gotta go. The boot, we, we gotta give the boot the boot. Just saying, I'm just saying. Okay. Throw that over there. 30 by 60. Oh, I know what this one, which one this is. This is one that I ordered and it is, okay, I'm just gonna leave the canvas as it is. I wanna let it rest naturally. Okay, so again, we got your generic 
tool kit, you got your tweezers that are wrapped around the pen, you got your strip of wax, you got your clear pen, which is gonna go to Rachel Ray if I ever get that package out, but I'm a procrastinator. Anyway, moving on now, squirrel. And you got your nine placer and your single placer and you got the white boat with the spout. That goes over there because I don't eat those. So now we'll look at the drills. I haven't done, if you don't like the sound of the crinkling, please mute your phone for about 10 seconds. So I've seen these being done. Oh, oh, and we get baggies. Oh, we get mini baggies. I don't like the baggies to begin with unless it comes kitted up. If it comes kitted up, I use the baggies because I'm lazy and I don't want to kit it up. So I don't like these, Mrs. Coffee. You'll be getting these ones too. So I've seen the mandalas getting done and I want to do a mandala. So this is what it looks like. It's pretty and it is a 40 by 40. It has uh, the 12 cat sank C set wheat nook these 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. It's got 30 colors in it. I love that there is an inventory sheet. I like the inventory sheets. This is good. Inventory sheet, good. No inventory sheet, bad. Just saying, just throwing it out there. So these here are the diamonds. It is square. It is a square diamond. It's more greens and grays. I don't want to take them all out of the packages, but it's green, it's grays. It's like, you know, you got some cream colors in there. Of course you got 310. When I go to kit it up, I'll look at it then, but I've got a lot to get through and I want to get this uploaded and done before Mrs. Coffee's live tonight. So. We're not gonna go through and count them and da 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 da. Just not gonna happen. But yeah, that's the diamonds. Okay, we're gonna put that there. She will pass that to the sister. So I'm not too happy right now with the way this canvas is looking. It's gonna have the oh. Okay, the boot's gotta go, you guys. The boot, I, I, mm. Okay, you can already tell this is gonna have bubbles and rivers. I don't like double-sided tape as it is. Oh yeah. 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 So I'm gonna be honest with you guys. It's got rivers, it's got bubbling, it's got training wheels. And I learned yesterday from a fellow creator what training wheels are. And what training wheels are is when you look at a diamond painting and you look at the drill field, and if you see that it's got black, you know, like the, like say if it's a round, and it's got a round, black round circle around every, that's the training wheels. And unless your drills are perfect, and I ain't not seen no perfect drills, you're gonna see those black lines. So it's got training wheels, it's got rivets, it's got bumps, it's got everything in this. I'm not happy with it. I will be contacting the company and letting them know Oh yeah, that was just nasty. I don't know if you guys can tell, but it, it's like the glue all bunched up from being in the boot. And it's like bunched up here. Oh, you can't see, it's bunched up here. You got a big line of rivet, rivering, bubbling going down there. And you got another one doing, oh, I'm not happy. I won't work on this canvas because it looks like crap. So I will be contacting the company and requesting a new canvas that is not sent in a boot. And I'm gonna tell them, please stop sending your diamond paintings in the boots. Put them around a, ro a foam roller to protect the canvas, something. But to me, this might as well just get bunched up, thrown in the garbage because I won't work on it. Gone, let's move on to the next one. 
next. Okay, you guys, this here is the last one. And then we're going to get into the Diamond Art Clubs. So this one here comes from Moon Zero Factory. I can't remember where that piece of crap came from, but I will have it linked down below. Do you know what? No, I'm not going to link that last one piece of crap down below because I don't want you ordering from them. I'm going to contact them myself and then I will update you guys down the road how that turned out. So this one comes from Moon Zero Factory Store on AliExpress. And again, it's got the boot. I don't like the boots. I'm hoping that everything is okay. There are, I ordered two things and then the order, the guy from the company contact, we know we were chatting back and forth and I accidentally ordered something from his nephew's store. Oh, I don't like these boots. Oh, but it's on a foam roller. Da -do -da, da -do -da. So you guys are going to get to see, oh, I need that piece of crap back. Squirrel. Okay, get rid of the garbage bag. Garbage bag, that can go. Okay, so as I was saying, I had accidentally ordered from the Moon Zero, a different store, which was his nephew's store. And I felt so bad because I want, I was, we were talking and, you know, I paid for this, but I think he was looking, you know, for a review because these companies can't, they can't fix something if they're not made aware of it. It, you know, everybody starts out somewhere. So, okay, he used the boot, but he also kept the canvas in a foam roller. Look at that, you guys. Foam roller, good. No foam roller, bad. Okay, we got that out of the way. We'll leave this here. So I ordered this painting. Aw, thank you. I see. He had mentioned to me after I placed my order that he was going to send me a special gift as a thank you for doing this for him. I said that's not necessary, but okay. So this is a square. So we'll set the gift aside to the side for right now. So I love the big trays. So I decided to order some that are gonna go out in my Canadian care packages for some friends. So I'm gonna set those to the side. I have enough of them. I might sticker them or I might make something fun for them, but these are gonna be going out in my Canadian care packages for some friends because I love these big white trays. Like they are so good, they got the spout. And if you really wanna give it a shake, what I'll do with the spout is I'll just stick a chunk of wax in there so they don't come pouring out and then you can really just ram it up like that. So we'll set those to the side. And let's get into the diamond painting. So here's the toolkit that came with the diamond painting. You get, it comes, it's, again, it's a generic toolkit, but that's okay, I'm a diamond painting addict. As you're gonna learn tomorrow in my show and share video of my Diamond Art Club stash, you get your pink pen, you get your three place or your single place, your chunk of wax, the white boat with the spout, at least it's not the green boat with no spout. And you get a few baggies in there and you get your stereotypical tweezers, perfect. Oh, give me one sec, folks, as you can hear my phone be ringing. And I'm back. What was a millisecond for you was about 10 minutes for me. I'm feeling a little bit rushed, but say la vie. It is what it is. All right, so foam roller, good. Right there. I do not want to take this off the foam roller, you guys. Um, it does have a little bit of damage, like a little bit of indenting in there. I'm sure it'll be fine. I want to leave it on the foam roller, and I want to for one reason why because I don't want to lay it out flat. I want to leave it as it is. And I know in a future video, we'll take a little bit better look at it as well as the one that came in a boot without a foam roller, 
This came in a boot with a foam roller. We will do a comparison video when I get home from vacation. Throw that over there. So, if you want to see the one that I chose, I'll just leave it right in the bag here. So, I love Beauty and the Beast. We'll take it out of the bag. This has 50 colors. 50 colors. I love Beauty and the Beast, and this says, till the last petal falls. It's kind of like Beauty goes rogue with the tattoos and the hair, and I absolutely loved this image. I love, oh, I'm wrong, you guys. It's got 59 colors. So it's got this whole row here. It's got this here. So 59 colors. Colors. I don't think I've ever had a painting with 59 colors. That's a lot of colors. That is a lot of colors. And I mean, like, you got this here, which is 310. Big bag of 310. Not quite sure. Oh, right there. Uh, okay, so here's my recommendation, if I can. I can barely make this out. It's 924. It would be so much better if they would not use black numbering if they would use lighter numbering, if it's a darker diamond, and then darker writing for lighter diamonds. If it's just something I'm throwing out there, I'm just saying, I don't think they're gonna change their thing because just little old me said that, but hey, I'm just saying. And then I've got one bag here of 3865, which is like an off version of white. It's kind of like a, I don't know, Looks pretty white to me, but 5,200 is the white weight. So we got a big bag of that. And then I've got this bag here, and I love these colors. You got like maroon and rose and pink and peach. And this probably will be a project that I am going to do in the near future. So here's how this worked. You've seen the trays, and for the five trays, I paid $9.14. For this diamond painting, which is a square 60 by 50, I paid $38.01. And that's Canadian. I got free shipping. I ordered this on June 25th. It arrived yesterday being July 25th, which was four weeks that's pretty average. I am so far with my first impression, I'm happy. I will know more when I come back and I take it out and I start looking at it a little bit more and a little bit more extensively. So this gentleman was so kind from Moon Fa Zero Factory Store that he said he was gonna throw in a gift to say thank you. And this is my thank you gift right here. So thank you very much for that. Is this a diamond painting pen? It says lipstick, but I don't think he sent me lipstick. It is. That is so cool. It says lipstick. It looks like a tube of lipstick, you guys. But you take the cap off and it comes down and there's your diamond painting pen. Is that not just pretty, that is pretty cool because I love diamond painting accessories. It's all of you guys, whether you're in the beauty community, the diamond painting community, it's the accessories. We all love the accessories. So I like that, that's cool and it's sturdy. I can push down, okay? That is pretty cool, okay? That is cool. I like that. So there's that there. So thank you for the diamond painting pen. And is this wax? It is too. Okay, so I got a thing of wax that says thank you. And this wax is white. I've used the red. I'm in the middle of using blue. I've never used white wax. So that'll be fun. 
and I got purple wax, purple, 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 we got purple wax. So now I'm gonna be able to kind of do that experiment from purple to blue to pink to white wax. And this here says thank you as well. So Moon Zero Factory Store, thank you very much for sending me this little gift. That, you know, and being so good with your customer service, because to me, customer service is a lot. You know, if you treat your customers well, they're gonna treat you well. And right now on my first impression, I would definitely say go check them out because what I like, you may not. And what you like, I might not. It's all about perception and our own personal experiences. And I'm gonna leave it at that, you guys. All right, so I'm gonna clean up here and then I'm gonna be back with the dun 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 diamond art club. See you in a millisecond. And I'm back. And I'm back with what I know you guys, what you're waiting for through this whole unboxing is the diamond art club. One is friend mail. One was my experiment. I never told anybody I was doing this experiment but I chose to do the experiment. And the experiment, I wrote everything down and we'll get there when we get there. So we're gonna open up this one first. I don't know which one is well, actually yes I do because one, okay this one's the experiment right here because it has a label on the side. So I know which one's the experiment. This one is the friend mail. And I'm gonna throw a picture in here because this person did not want to be named. And I respect that because I've sent things out where I said I don't want to be named. So I respect that, but I'm going to throw a photo in right about here. So as you can tell, I recognized when she sent me the photo so I am so excited because today she teased me and said, it's a big one. It's a big one. I'm like, why? You know I can't open it right now. Okay. I'm going to go like this. There's the slip. I'm going to go like this. Yeah, it's a big one. Okay, so I'm gonna go like this and you guys are gonna get to see it before me. So that's the one that she chose for me because she said she's seen me mention it on a video. Okay, and I'm praying I don't have it. I'm gonna look. Oh, are you kidding me? She called me Suzu Love? This one, I saw it, and I said I wanted it, but then I never ordered it. And it's one of those ones where it kind of sits in the back of your mind, do I want it, don't I want it? And then all the new releases come out, and you never order it for yourself. Oh my God, thank you. I gotta open this up. Wow. Like I said, you guys, this is not mandated. Like you don't have to do this. You really, truly don't. Do I appreciate it? Yes, because I've been on the no buy for so long. And wow, this is the third Diamond Art Club that's been sent to me. And like I said, it's not something that you have to do. And if you're not sure, but you want to, oh, I don't even need to say it. It's in the description box. I'm trying. I'm such a crybaby. When did I become such a crybaby? I've never been a crybaby. I think it was when you watched your grandson come into the world. Is that when the change shifted? That's when I noticed it. Okay. Yeah, I think almost delivering my grandson on my bathroom floor pretty much did that for me. Oh, 
thank you so much. You know who you are. Wow. Okay, so we got the typical Diamond Art Club toolkit, your two hearts of wax, your pen, your squishy, few baggies, the tweezers because this is a square. How big is this one? 47 by 84. Holy Hannah Barbara. And then you got your, yeah, you got all, that's the toolkit. We don't have a toolkit. We don't need to look at the toolkit. Let's open this up. And tomorrow for story time, Saturday, I'm going to share the story of how I became a diamond, how I became diamond art addiction. Oh my God. I'm just shaking right now. Oh, come look at this done. Oh, wow. Is that not gorgeous? That is gorgeous. I know you guys probably can't see it the best. Oh, 42 colors. It's got one, it's got one AB, one four one. It is square. Oh, it's got your schematic up here. It's got your schematic down there. It's got two bags of drills. We, that can go into garbage. Thank you, my sister. It's got two bags of drills. And I, this is a Mandy Manzano. She's one of my favorite artists. And Chuck, Chuck Pinson is becoming one of my favorites. And JoJo's Art is another one of my favorites. This has got a lot of 310. Okay, you guys, I really don't want to take the drills out of the bag. I suck at putting them back in. But look at that orange and browns. And you've got some greens and purples. And, and, and. Wow. I am just flat. I just, I, I don't even know what to say. Except thank you. Thank you that you thought of me and that you, I never would have bought this one for myself. I'll be honest, you guys, I won't. I liked it. I wanted it, but I just never got it. And I'm just flabbergasted. So thank you. So this one here has a lot of 3371s. You can see your 310s. You've got some browns, some oranges. Wow. Okay. Wow. Okay, you guys. So I'm going to pause you. Well, I'll be back. I'm going to wrap this back up and then we're going to get to my experiment box. And that'll be it for this video. So I will be right back. I got my bearings together. I did my grooves for Bob. And we're ready to get on to the experiment. Oh, hey, you're, if you hear something in the background, that's just my sister helping me, as she usually does, put my other painting away. So what I mean by experiment, you guys, is I did the shipping experiment. So I ordered, so here we go. When you are Canadian and you need to have, you know, you want Diamond Art Club, you can do the $17.95 American for, or which is 2368 Canadian for DHL and DHL sucks. I don't like DHL delivery. So normally when you do DHL, it's 10 to 14 dates from date of order, usually 14, two to three weeks on a good shipment. I've had shipments that have taken almost a month to get to me. And I'm like, this is bullshit. Why, why is this taking so long? And I contacted Diamond Art Club and they're like, we are so sorry, we understand, you know? And then they came up with a new shipping method for us in Canada through FedEx. And their FedEx is 24.95 American which works out to $32.91 Canadian. I ordered this last Saturday from the new releases on my son's birthday. And I call this 
a gift from my son because I no longer grieve him, but I celebrate him. So I ordered this last Saturday, July 20th. It shipped Tuesday, July 23rd, and I received it today, July 26th, three days. So my Canadian friends, I highly recommend if you want your shipment to come faster, say bye-bye DHL, hello FedEx, because that's what I'm going to be doing now. Well, except for tomorrow. I am ordering from Diamond Art Club tomorrow on the new releases, but I'm going to pay for the DHL only because I'm going on vacation. And it'll, it should arrive around the week that we get back from vacation, which is perfect for me. But on a go forward basis, I will be ordering FedEx from Diamond Art Club because when new releases come out, we want them now. I don't want to wait three weeks and meanwhile I've seen 20 unboxings, right? Like I'm so excited for this unboxing right now. Like do, 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 okay, quit squirreling Sherry and open the box. Cause you guys are probably all screaming at me. Open the box. Can you throw these boxes just down the stairs for me, my sister? Thank you very much, I appreciate that. It's nice to have a little bit of help when you're filming. Okay, so you're probably wondering which one I got from the new releases. I better not take my time because I got to get this uploaded. Okay, I ordered on Golden Shores. Is that not just stunning? Oh, the, the clear, clear bag. Oh, Diamond Art Club, you just... Oh, I love me, my Diamond Art Club. I like a lot of companies, but I definitely have to say my addiction is Diamond Art Club. It is a square diamond painting. It is a 74 by, is that not gorgeous? That is gorgeous. 74 by 55. Okay, I want to see if you do the DAC asthma. So you got to come over here when I unwrap this. So we're going to do the canvas first. Then we'll look at some of the drills. Well, not all of them. So, okay, here's the toolkit. Yeah, we've seen that before. Great, cool. We, 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 once you see a toolkit, you see them all. Diamond Art Club does have a good toolkit. Okay, okay, so are we ready? Oop, aren't I being rude? She did it, she did that. <gasps> Look at that. That is beautiful. Is it not just gorgeous? And this has got, okay, so this is my third Chuck Pinson diamond painting. You guys have now seen me, I think, unbox two. You don't know what the third one is. I did not do an unboxing on my channel. He has, I've never liked landscapes, you guys. I have not liked landscapes until Chuck Pinson came into my life. And he has some amazing artwork to the point he got me to like landscapes. I didn't think that was ever gonna happen. I'd see landscapes, I'm like, yeah, that's nice. It just wasn't for me to each their own. And then Chuck happened. Chuck, Chuck, Chuck. So this has 48 colors. It's got one, two, three, no, one, two, three. It's got three ABs. It's got three AB diamonds, of course. With the new ones, you get the stickers. I love the stickers. Look at that, you guys. Is that not just beautiful? Gorgeous. And I love the way the different pinks are in the sky here. 
and you got some blocking. I like blocking more over confetti, but I will do confetti if I have to do confetti. But, oh, it's got purples and blues and greens and just, okay, I gotta do this. I gotta do it. I gotta go do, 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 I'm just trying to make it fun while I roll it. <laughs> Squirrel! Is that not just gorgeous? To me, this is beautiful. Okay, so we already know, we know we know this. Sticky drill field is good. It's clear, no training wheels. Thank you for teaching me that, my creator friend. I didn't know what that was and we learned something new every day. Wow, that is just I, like beautiful. And I like the way the colors blend, right? Like that's how you get that really nice effect. And I think when I watched Mrs. Coffee unbox this, she said something about new square diamonds. And I'm thinking new. So I'm not gonna unbag the diamonds. You've got pinks, purples. You've probably already seen it when someone else unboxed it. So I'm not gonna torture myself by trying to figure out how to get it back in the bag like this. I don't know how Diamond Art Club does it, but hi. Oh, so you've already seen these. You don't need me to do it all over again. My first impression, of course, stunning. So when I do my show and share of my Diamond Art Club stash video tomorrow, I'm gonna share my ups and downs with my love of Diamond Art Club. Um, and we'll leave it at that. You're gonna get to see ones that I haven't finished, ones that I'm working on, and ones that are in my stash. I'm kind of doing my show and share a little bit differently, and then I will do my non Diamond Art Club stash. And that'll be a little bit less of a squirrely. Though it might be, it's going to be squirrely, but not as I'm not feeling rushed. And I really hope that I didn't come across as I was rushing. But, you know, I got to show respect. And I'll just leave it at that. So, on that note, you guys, I'm going to bid you all farewell. I look forward to sharing my Diamond Art Club stash with you guys tomorrow. So until the next time, many, many blessings. Stay positive. Live blessed. Hashtag Vibe Tribe. Bye, guys.